my name is Maya today's video is going to be a week in my life so yeah it's 2 30 I have therapy at 3 it's just like on zoom and I'm like 99.9% .9 sure I'm about to tell my therapist I don't want to do therapy anymore like I don't know it's just not giving like we had had a conversation about like her life and like she had like, like shared like a small amount like of information but I'm about to just tell y'all whatever so <laughs> So she told me that her wife is a pastor because if y'all don't know i'm bisexual and so i chose to like see a therapist that you know um they didn't have to be queer but like they you know work with people that are queer and so she told me that her pastor was i mean that her wife was a pastor and i was like okay cool like i have a lot of questions about that and she was like being weird like why are you being weird to me like she was like um okay well like i don't know i guess i could tell you like a little bit about um my life but you know we're not gonna be friends so we're not i'm not gonna tell you this so we can be instagram buddies like babes i never said i wanted to be your instagram buddy i just had some fucking questions and now i don't have any now i don't have one now i don't even want to be here you know like babes i don't even want to be here no more it just really gave me oh now i'm gonna upset and i gotta go talk to her in like 30 minutes ah! whatever i don't care i must just be like no like it's not giving <laughs> like no seriously like i'm laughing but i'm dead ass like no i'm not loving it like i feel like therapy is already really complicated because it's like you're paying a stranger you know to talk like you're, you're paying a stranger so you can talk to them and i just don't love that idea like i know they're supposed to be professional and stuff but for me it's just i don't know like i don't know if it's that therapy is not for me or if therapy is just not for me right now i just i don't know i definitely I'm not working with her no more. I'm about to just tell her that. I'm about to be like, yeah, I just don't think that this is gonna work. Like, and I don't even know how long this therapy session's gonna be, but I'm really about to just be like, yeah, I'm just really not feeling this, you know? I just really didn't like that. And it just really cleared up for me that I'm not really fucking with this whole thing. And then my school, I either get free um, therapy or like $5 therapy sessions with my, my, my <laughs> toaster shibble juice. Uh, just popped. But I either get free therapy sessions with my school or five dollar therapy sessions and i go to her and it's 150 dollars. and after a certain point like my school's like insurance or whatever pays for it but babes like i'm barely getting anything out of this and you're charging me 150 dollars. and if i miss it babes you're fired <laughs> like no seriously you're done you're done so that's how I'm feeling, that's how I'm working doing it. I feel really good about it because I thought about this like since last week. Since the middle of our session last week, I was like, yeah, this this is not gonna work. Like, this isn't for me. And I sat on it, I thought about it. I'm sticking to it. So it's a little bit later, I'm about to have this therapy session. Um, and then I'm actually meeting with my friend. She's gonna come to my house and we're gonna study together. So I'll show you guys um, her on the vlog. But I'm also, I'll, I'll let y'all know how I'm feeling about this therapy session we gonna see how it go we gonna see okay so i did cancel therapy with my therapist and i was really honest with her like about everything i was like i was gonna record it and then i was like no i don't want to record because i feel like you know you're like hipaa like i have privacy with my therapist but if i like record it and all that that might like go of the privacy that i have and like the protections i have so i was like nah let me not record it but i'll tell you what happened I basically told her how i felt about it and she was just like 
oh, I don't remember saying that. And she was like, okay, well, I didn't want to make you feel like that. I was just setting up a boundary. And I was like, I know, I just made, it just made me feel like, you know. And it was really awkward. Like, she was like, okay, well, you still have this time. Like, do you want to talk about anything? And I was like, not really. So she was like asking me questions so that I could start talking. And we mainly just talked about YouTube and, and Instagram and all that and stuff and like content. Um, so yeah i mean i feel good i'm glad that this is over for a while like i might go back to therapy again but i'm definitely not paying this much for therapy like in the near future because i just feel like it's just too much um so yeah i'm about to go downstairs um and meet my friend so we can get to study i have to get this paper done today so oh my selfies you got here but i think i'm gonna film an entire unboxing on it tomorrow so i don't think i want to unbox it today um but i will like show you all tomorrow after i do the unboxing so stay tuned for the unboxing video How is it coming along? It's coming. <laughs> Slowly. <laughs> so I'm still working on my paper. Um, it's really like the outline, but I feel like once the, the outline comes together, it'll be good. <laughs> um, so yeah, got some coffee. Things are good. <laughs> okay hey guys so i'm back from yoga um yoga was like very relaxing today it wasn't like super intense like i didn't really sweat or anything um so i didn't get like a huge like sweat but i still felt like you know i moved my body which is good um and i feel really good about that uh so i have some packages so the first package is this is my tell easy and i'm gonna do like an entire unboxing video on this so i won't be unboxing it in this vlog but there will be an entire unboxing video so make sure y'all tune in for that um but i do have these amazon packages that i can show y'all um i got okay i thought i dropped some i got some like fitness clothes and stuff so i got this three pack of fitness shirts so i got one in like this teal color love um and then i got this other one in gray and it's a medium and then i have this like black but it's really giving me like darker like a gray looky so i got three of these um these will be linked below in my amazon home so you guys can get them i think they were like around 25 dollars for a three pack which is actually pretty good um so glad to have those and then this is a set. Oh, hold on. Let's get this open. Ooh. Okay, this isn't looking right. I'm sorry, you're not looking great. Unless they get put something extra in here. So it's supposed to be like this black, yeah, this black fitness set. Um okay oh actually it's very nice oh my god guys this is like i'm gonna try on all this stuff for you guys i just decided because i'm like this is so nice okay so it's this black like um sports bra and it's ribbed but like the material on the inside is like this different kind of material it's so well made oh my god what okay it definitely says wash by hand which will not be happening so that's nerve-wracking um and then here are the bottoms i got them in a, a medium again um and then it came with the scrunchie that's what i thought i was seeing i thought they got me like a polka dot shirt and i was like no that's not what i asked for but it's just a little scrunchie which is a cute little dish and okay let me like hop into this so that i can show you guys um the, the like the full look um so just give me a second 
If anybody cares, this is what I actually wore to yoga today, which is this shirt. I think this is from Old Navy. It could be from Cotton On. I have no idea. And I just have some really normal leggings on. Like, they're very thin. Like, nothing special at all. And then I just put my little headband on. And I was going... I didn't even put on a sports bra today. I just, I just live life. Okay, so here's what it looks like. I love this. Like, definitely would give it, like five out of five it's so cute the top is pretty well supported i actually have like a bit of room for reference i do wear a double d i know it doesn't look like it i swear i do um and i feel pretty supported there's like it's like definitely medium support it's not anything crazy but i don't feel like constricted which i always feel so constricted in sports bra so i love that i don't um and like the material just feels like such good quality this definitely like isn't feeling very thin or anything like this this is how my butt looks like looks in it i mean my butt looks big and everything i'm not gonna lie like in most things because i have a pretty big butt so i wouldn't gauge how your butt's gonna look like but my mind looks like a big butt <laughs> i'm not gonna lie um but i do think that it's very very cute set and it's like high-waisted enough to the point where i don't call oh, the baby's crying hold on hi mama are you okay the baby was crying sorry my bad hold on let me put her down um but it's like high-waisted enough to the point where i feel i don't know i still feel like it's cute and i feel comfortable like i don't feel like my whole like stomach is all the way out um so i feel really good in this this will be linked again on my Amazon home, and I'm gonna pop on the shirt so we can get a feel for the shirts. Um, let's do this shirt first, because this is the one with the most color. Okay, so if I was gonna pop on a shirt, this is a comfortable shirt. Um, this is a medium, I'm not gonna lie. I definitely feel like I could have gotten a small in this. Like, it's a little bit looser than I would have liked it to be. I like my tank tops for yoga to be like a little bit more tight um but it's not bad by any means like it'll definitely work um again i feel comfortable um in this set without a shirt so i probably would wear it like just like this but if i wanted to pop on a shirt this would be like a nice shirt to put on top it's fine um, i'm sure we can get the gist of the other shirts <laughs> for looking at this one it's fine like it, it works it does its job if you just wanted to get a couple extra shirts uh for your workouts this is a good fit for it if you have a bunch already it's not something that you need to like go out and like hurry up and buy it's not that great but it's just like you know if you need it this is an option um so yeah i am about to take a shower and stuff um i did not finish my paper i did like a good portion of the um outline like thoroughly like detailed outline i literally did uh like quotes and everything in there which is like amazing love that for me um so i'm going to take a shower and then uh, i'm gonna um, i'm gonna try to like crank out as much of that paper as i can in an hour um and i have like a little bit of cleaning and stuff to do before then <sighs> tomorrow's a big day tomorrow's content day you guys know tuesdays are content days so i have a lot to do tomorrow and that means i need to get some sleep so i can't just be slacking and lagging and up all night um so to the shower <sighs> Okay, so hey guys, so I look crazy, but I actually worked on my um, closet and I like completely like cleaned it out um, and like did laundry like you know your girl did a lot she did a lot i'm gonna show you guys my closet um but it's like 12 something and i haven't ate any 
I need to eat um, and I also have that paper remember that paper that I forgot about that I decided to not do so I'm on I'm on FaceTime with my friend <laughs> I mean mm, my friend mm. <laughs> We don't, we don't have to call each other. Okay, anyway. But, <laughs> but yeah, I'm about to get that done. I'm going to show you guys my closet real quick and then on to the paper. Okay, I don't know if it's going to look like much, but there was like a bunch of stuff down there. And there's not barely any. And like I clean like most of the stuff by my, um, you know, with my shoes and stuff. And we can see floor. So that's definitely a start. I seeing the floor, it's a good start. I do need to fix this um, purse situation. So I will get on that. Yeah, I just feel like I made some really good progress. I feel like it was a success. Um, but I'm just gonna call it a night for, you know, recording for tonight. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, so I just did my makeup and I did my eyelash, like extensions, fill, whatever. I am stressed out today. Bestie's going through stuff right now with her fucking braider. Um, it's like a whole thing. So I'm about to get dressed, um, film the first video, and move on with the rest. I'm. It's already 1.30. Four-ish videos to film, pictures to take, and a short amount of time. So. Let's get into it. Okay, so it's time to do the first outfit. This is the first outfit of today. Um, it's this, okay, so it's a whole situation. So we've got this brown top, hold on. Okay, we've got this brown like v-neck crop top um, and then I've got some American Eagle jeans and I've got this like little cheap purse I got from Shein so I thought that would be really cute together. And then I've got some clear heels to pair with it. So this is the first look we're gonna film the first video and then i'll be back so it's 3 48 i'm eating some chocolate pretzels from trader joe's i got two videos done so i did my unpacking of my telfer and i also did my nail video and i am transferring the images right now i hope they came out good i don't know for sure but i have to hustle it <laughs> to get some pictures in so that's my goal to at least get like you know one picture in today so i'm about to head up to the um I'm about to head up in my building and take some pictures, but I'm making myself some coffee and I'm like trying to like shove a little bit of food in my stomach right now because I still have two more videos to film. Well. Hey guys, so I'm actually up here on the rooftop and I was smart <sighs> and I brought um, my little slippers. 
so I did have to walk on my heels. So these are like little clear heels from Fashion Nova. They're very cute. Um, I'm gonna, I just got them for my trip, but I'm about to use them to take pictures. Um, I love a good clear, I love a good clear heel. I mean, these are just my, my Uggs, I love these. Um, this was like quite an adventure <laughs> because I had to bring, okay, so I had to bring my tripod, brought my heels in hand, my little keys, and I brought a purse for the outfit. So I'm about to take pictures. Yeah. So I got my pictures in my first outfit. I got some TikToks. So I ordered some Chick fil A too. It's like four o'clock. So I'm like racing the sun right now. Um, I'm about to take a, a few more pictures and I'm going to like take some sitting down. So I'm excited about that. Um, make sure you guys follow me on Instagram so you guys can see all of the stuff that I post, all the outfits and stuff. Um, but I'm going to do all of that um, and then get to filming the next two videos. Influencer issues. So I'm literally halfway through. My makeup is really like oily today and I think it's because I didn't do like a step because Today's just been a lot. I literally had to redo my entire makeup to make it work It was like this whole situation, but it, it all worked out in the end for the most part, but I'm in the middle of filming right now and the battery to my um, external like when, what is it like my external field monitor i'll show you guys it it's this like yeah so this is my external field monitor that i use and i put it on the top of my camera so that i can see everything for um so i can see everything while i'm you know recording <sighs> i can barely talk so i can see everything when i'm recording so there's this has a battery which is really annoying i wish i would have gotten one that was like rechargeable or something i don't know just different um and so this back here this battery died so the other one's sitting in there and it's charging and my brain told me to plug it in before I left and I didn't do it and it's just this whole thing so I think I'm just gonna take a break and eat chick-fil-a and then get back to it I'm just gonna give up on filming for today like filming other videos because I'm trying to do this try on haul and the lighting is just not it's just not doing what it needs to do I'm also like super hungry and I already filmed two videos today so I'm glad I did that and I also got some pictures done so tomorrow I'm gonna try to film my pack with me and then also this try on haul and we'll see we'll see how it goes I was gonna put on my yoga set like I actually put it on and then I was like um I want to be comfortable I still have like two hours until I go it's 4 51 and I don't leave to like 7 or something like that Oh, I have a headache. I just took some medicine. I'm about to eat. Got some Chick-fil-A. Um, if I don't feel better in like an hour, I'm going to just tell them I don't feel good and I'm not going to go to yoga because I just, I don't know. My body feels so tired. Um, and I still have like a part of my essay to fix. So I might end up saying no to yoga tonight. But if I don't, you guys want to, obviously. But I got Chick-fil-A. This is supposed to be like my lunch. Depending on how, how late I stay up tonight, it's still my food. But I got a free mac and cheese, which is cool because they're doing like a free medium mac and cheese. Um, oops, I got fries, which are super cold. I'm about to go heat them up. Also got my spicy deluxe with pepper jack and I take off the pickles because yuck and I love to change it out and eat a bite of Polynesian and a bite of buffalo I did it wrong hand Polynesian and the buffalo so I'm gonna eat and then I'm gonna watch my Netflix and I'm gonna enjoy my life I got back from yoga a while ago. My hair is literally everywhere. Um, it's been a while. I've been on this couch for like two hours. I'm not even, no, no, no. Yep, like two hours. <laughs> I was thinking about it. Um, so I'm about to work on my paper and then I finally took a shower um, and eat and stuff. So yeah, but yoga was great. I, I bought a bra. Um, when I get up, I'll show you guys the bra that I bought from like my yoga studio. It was like $40. I feel like I overpaid for it a bit, but hopefully it feels really good. And yeah. So I was actually quite productive. I 
um, edited two videos. Um, I'm still working on one of them, but it's pretty much done. So that's good. I feel good about it. I also worked on an essay with my aunt. So I'm about to call it, um, for an, I'm going to call it for the night. It's already like about to be 3 a.m. So yeah. <laughs> So today is Wednesday. Um, Tuesday was supposed to be like the only create content creation day, but I just it didn't work out like that. I have to do stuff today. So we're filming the pack with me today and um, the fashion of a book like bodycon dress try on haul thing. Um, so I'm dressed. I got this little dress from some little like cheap store in the mall. Um, but I want to finish making the TikToks. Then I think we're gonna do we're gonna take pictures right yes okay we're gonna take pictures and then we'll get to doing like the rest of the video so things are good things are good say hi boo <laughs> for black women hair has always been critical to their lived experiences the relationship between black women and their hair is particularly complex. Black women's hair is intricately connected to their identity. The historical and political nature of black women's hair in conjunction with the political position of black women due to their intersectionality of blackness and womanhood for the complicated relationship between black women and their hair. Guys, so it's Friday. I took off my wig yesterday. It was just like this whole thing because I'm getting ready for my Cancun trip. Like, as you guys know, I just like had a lot to do. Like, I had to do course evaluations. I had to turn in my 25 page paper, which I turned in. Yes. Boop, boop, boop. Um, it ended up being like 29 pages um, with like my title, my references, but so excited. Uh, then I took down my hair. Then I was freaking out about my hairline because I've been wearing wigs. Okay, so I got, I have a wig um, that I'm supposed to be wearing on my trip, but it's too fucking light. It's way too light. I'm about to go to like the beauty supply. Like we got a lot to do. So the first thing on our list is eyebrows. So we're about to go do that right now. Um, I'm gonna show you guys the whole process. So. <laughs> so boom i got the wig on i dyed it and all of that um it's a little bit darker when it's wet but i think it's still like very pretty you can see the lace just a little bit but i don't care i'm gonna tie my hair down and it is what it is and i think it looks really 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 good honestly considering um yeah like if we move back a little bit it's perfect so i'm feeling good about it um if you guys want to see the rest of the week with me make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up subscribe and turn notifications on thank you guys for watching this video i appreciate you guys so much this is the end of the video um if you guys yeah so make sure you, this is the end of the video um and i'll talk to you guys in the next one bye guys